For BlueShirtsUnited.com, I'm Jim Cerny, joined by Ryan Klo. And first question for you, new Ranger here. You finally get some sleep after last night. Yeah, yeah it was nice <laughs> to get some rest. I, uh, you know, I had the adrenaline pumping. Uh, I think that got me through the game. And then as soon as the game was over and uh, I got back to the hotel and had some dinner, uh, you know, I think I was running on fumes there for a while. And then <laughs> it was nice to lay in bed. Uh, I was pretty excited, so it took me a little bit to get to sleep. But I felt a little bit better and a little more refreshed today anyway. <laughs> well, were you legit when you were saying, you, you know, you, f you flew across country, of course, from California, you red eye to get here to New York for the morning skate. Did you really sleep that little on the plane on the way over? You said it was like a half hour or so? Yeah, I did. I couldn't sleep. I was, uh, <laughs> you know, I just, it was actually a really bumpy ride and uh, it was a lot of turbulence. I just, I was too, you know, I was a little bit obviously with the excitement of coming here and thinking everything's going through your mind. It's tough to fall asleep at that <laughs> stage. So when I got in, I did a little skate. Same thing at the afternoon, at the, after the afternoon pregame nap, I, I slept for like an hour because usually I'll sleep for a couple of hours. Same thing, I couldn't wait to get to the rink. So uh, last night, I kind of, I guess the body shut down. <laughs> now, now, the hockey's one end of it, but you know, you get traded and you know, within a matter of hours, you're on a plane, you're flying across the country. There's this whole other life that you got to settle as well. It's not just about the hockey, you know, that's what the fans are most concerned yeah. about. But how do you work through all that? You've never had to do this before. Yeah, that's a that's an adjustment for sure. I think, uh, especially coming to New York, and you know, there's so much going on here. And uh, you know, the guys have been great. They've been, you know, and this organization is so great. Everyone wants to help. Uh, you know, the staff, all the guys, or whatever you need. Uh, so they've taken care of me really well so far. Um, so as that, I mean, it's just kind of you're, we're at that stage where we're, you know we're going on the road now. We're playing so many games every other day. So you're almost in that routine where it's not like you got a whole lot of time to think about anything else but hockey. So. You know, I'm uh, I'm focused on this month. I'm sure I'll fit in uh, fine. You know, once once we get a, some days in between games here, I'll probably uh, work on getting adjusted and situated. And, uh, but I'm I'm just really excited. Not a lot of not a lot of time in between games. You got three three yeah, games, yeah. four days coming up on the road and all that. Yeah. You, you know, you've been the veteran guy in San Jose, welcoming in new teammates and helping them get adjusted and what have you. Do you take anything out of that when, because this is your first go around doing this, and of course, you know, you're, you have a comfort level from where you were and all that, and now you kind of turn your world upside down. Do you kind of go back on your experience of having been the guy that helped others out before? Yeah, and I, you know, I think that was important there, just like it is here. I think guys come in, even if uh, you're a bit of an older guy, it's still all new. You don't, you know, most part, you don't know all the guys, and you don't know more than anything, you don't know how things kind of work around here. And, uh, you like to get pointers and, and what to do, what not to do. So uh, just kind of get the guys together and welcome the guys. And, you know, the guys, uh, we all went to dinner last night, so that was nice to get to know and meet some of the guys a little more, hang out and chat. And, uh, you know, I think the guys have been great so far with that. And for me, you know, I, uh, I talked to Hammerlock a little bit. He was like, you know, I've been, I've been with a bunch of teams, so you get used to it. He's like, for you, it's and same as his first time, he said it's just a, it's a big, big shock and a big difference. And you know it is. It's a there's a lot of different things about here, but all positive things, which uh, which is great. Was there a little bit of a, a cool factor to 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 make up a phrase? A cool factor putting on that Blue Ranger jersey, skating out Madison Square Garden, being in the starting lineup, being out there for the anthems and all that. Was there a little bit of a, a cool factor for you? Yeah, it was great. I thought, uh, and I love. How the blue looks, and uh, I love the red <laughs> pants. And, uh, yeah, a little different uh, from yeah, the teal. Yeah, it's great. <laughs> I thought it uh, fit in real nice in the uniform, and uh, it was awesome. You know, in warm up, I just caught myself looking around a few times, just saying, you know, what a what a great moment this is. And you know, everyone I talked to who played here and, uh, always said it's a, it's a special place to play, and you know, to wear that Rangers blue. So I'm stoked. And slapping that Broadway hat on your hat after the game too. That's that's pretty cool. You couldn't have scripted a much better debut, could you? No, no, I was. Uh, I couldn't ask for much more than that. And just the fact that to be able to score in the first period, I think, was you know almost like a double whammy. Score my first goal of the year, and then obviously score in a Rangers uniform too. So get kill two birds with one stone, I guess. And uh, you know it was really nice. I, uh, you know, it's been a kind of an up and down year for me. So to have a real good game like that, it feels real nice. Well, sounds good. Welcome to New York. I know we'll be talking a lot to you, and uh, we certainly uh, look forward to your tenure here with the Rangers. Yeah, yeah. Thank you.